Welcome to my channel. In today's video, I'm going to be showing you how you can make your own custom nail decals. So this is perfect for those who want to start their own nail business or for people who just like to do nails at home, especially during these quarantine times. Um, but I'm going to be showing you how you can make them super easy using Canva. And we will be using a template um, that is available on Etsy if you'd like to purchase that I've made myself. Um, but yeah, we'll be using a, cam a template just to make it super easy for us. So. Um, to begin, uh, if you have already purchased the template, this is the PDF file that you will receive. Uh, it just gives instructions on how to use the template the same way I'm going to be recording this video. Um, same information that's going to be in it. So all you would do from here is click Nail Decal Templates. It's going to bring you to Canva. Okay, you can see a little preview. And then you click Use Template. Okay, so what we do from here is you're going to see all the templates that are included in the bundle deal that you get when you purchase from me on Etsy. Um, I believe it's like four different types of decals plus one bonus. The bonus is this one that you can fit four on the sheet, so you save a lot of money with this one. Um, yeah, but like say you, you know, download this template and you want to only make these three. Like you don't want to deal with the other ones right now. Um, right now, I'm going to be in this video actually showing you how to use this one and this one. Um, it's the same kind of concept with everything else after you learn those two. But I'm just going to delete these pages. That's all you have to do. Just delete the pages that you do not want to use. Just like that. Okay. So now what we're going to do is we're going to go into our uploads. So here's the templates that we're going to use. Like I said, we're going to be doing some marble nails and some Ariana nails. Okay. So for the first one, we're going to do some marble. All you'd have to do is go on um, line, search up like whatever you're looking for. So if it's like marble nails, you would literally just go online. Let me search your um, new window. And we'll search up marble background. And then you can go and choose your images. So I chose this one, as you see, and then you just download it and save the image. Um, so that's how I got that one. And then what we do, drag and drop. Drag and drop, drag and drop, drag and drop. If you want to see how to upload it, I'll show you guys that as well. You just click upload media device. Um, the one that I got was brown marble, and then you literally just drag and drop. <laughs> okay. Um, now we're going to add the green ones. Green. So simple. And if you're like, oh, but I don't want it to all be the same like that, you can literally just go like this like this and just move it you can make it bigger you can literally do anything you want which is cool like the, you can yeah the world is your oyster with this <laughs> okay so just move it around make it bigger like literally do anything that you want so for the second one here now we're going to do an ariana one so the thing with these ones is i provided this template which is like a half and half we do have this template available in this style as well like the oval style halfway but this is perfect for those who want like decals like full nail decals to cover the full nail and just the small decals that we're used to like those little tiny like ones that you can just put on top of like designs and that kind of stuff so this is really good for those kinds of people who want to get you know the best of both worlds so what you're going to do is you're going to get some images you want full you know background images in order to put on the full nail so this one for example drag and drop it you can put this one if you want you can like i said move it and add it to like how you want it like that and like i said keep in mind like for example this one the background looks white but um or looks like clear i guess because this is also white, the paper is also white, but once this prints, like it's gonna print with that background as well. So just keep that in mind in case like people are like, oh what? I thought it was transparent, like they thought the color was gonna show over or something like that. No, unless it's like a PNG, like you're gonna see the background. So yeah, you're gonna add those images, just keep adding in whatever images you want. Obviously, you can choose more than that. I will show you how you can like search for images too. So bring it here. Um where, did I just open a, a new tab? New window. Okay, yeah. So what you would do is Ariana Grande. Okay. And I'm going to show you guys actually how you could. So this is where you would find images. You would just like click on one of these, click it, and save image. Boom. 
that's not what we want. We want um, a nice image that we can make into a PNG. So Ariana Grande white background. So I showed you guys how you can get like the regular ones for full nails. Those ones are super easy. Um, if you want to make a PNG file, like you want to make um, one of those like sticker like things, I'm going to show you guys how you can do that now. So what you would do is, like I said, you want to find something that has a white background or something that's very like clearly different. Like this, for example, something that's clearly very clear like you can separate that the system would be able to separate without any struggles so i think this is already a png but um i don't know let's see if there's anything else i can use that's the one i made earlier let's see if there's any more okay let's see if we can try to do it with this just to see how that works out so we're going to save it as Ariana 5, save, we're going to go to background remover. This is what I use. I use this one, remove.bg. You're going to upload your image, Ariana 5, and then let's see what it can do. Yeah, so it will remove the background for you there, then you can download it. And then once you do that, I'll exit out of here. So now we're back over here. We're going to go to our uploads. So we're going to upload media and we're going to upload this one, Ariana 5. So this is how, so like I said, we have these ones and we have this. So we're going to put, let's also put some of these, finish this up here. But now what you're going to want to do for the PNGs, as you can see, these are all the PNGs I have for this, this one, this one, and that. All you need to do is you can click on it like that. You can drag it in. You can do whatever you want. There's many ways and just resize that's it <laughs> resize the images and put them where you want them so like this boom you can like make sure that they're aligned um you know create whatever size you want and just kind of You know, move it around and do what you have to. So yeah, and then you want to do that. Control C. You can copy and paste and just like sorry, I'm using the Control C and B um, shortcuts right now. Yeah, so like you would literally just click like that and move it around. And just whatever, like until you are satisfied with how it looks. Do different sizes or whatever floats your boat. Um, copy, paste, the small one. Okay, so boom, and then say so you're like you're super happy with this. You're like this is perfect. I want this printed right now. Um, what I would do is, like I said, the branding, um, you can use the same font or whatever you want to do, but what I would suggest is just ungrouping it. I did group all of these images here just because it makes it super easy without it like moving around on you to um, work with it, but you can ungroup it. So say we're going to make it, the thing is called um, Nails I Love. I don't know. I'm making up a random brand. Nails I Love. Is your brand you would just put in your your logo here you can switch it up you can change the font um we use anonymous pro go like this make it bigger do whatever you want and then i would recommend just right after doing that um grouping it back up again just to make it easier for yourself but um that's what you would do once you're happy and satisfied with um, the decals you have you're going to want to click download and remember to download as a jpeg you need to do this because you do not want all that hard work to go to waste and because if you don't download it as a JPEG, it could possibly resize the decals and once you print them out, they might not fit the nail the way that you wanted them to. So print them as a JPEG just to keep to make sure to keep that image or that um, size. And what you can do here is just put in the title like marble, oops, I could spell, marble Ariana. And then you're gonna click download. So oh, download JPEG, download. So now it's gonna download your image here. 
and this stuff is all going to pop up in your face. We're going to go to our files. We're going to go to downloads, and it's going to be the last one. So when you pull it up, this is exactly what it's going to look like once you print it. You want to click print and get your settings all going. Okay, so make sure that you have it in landscape because, like I said, it's facing this way. So you want to make sure you have it in landscape if it prints portrait. It's just not right. So <laughs> make sure it's in landscape. Um, and then you're going to click print. So make sure another thing is you're going to be wanting to print these um, on water slide paper. Um, I will leave in the link the bio or the link. Oh my God. I will leave in the description bar below um, the link to the paper that I'm going to be using or the paper that I do use and the um, water, the spray that I use because you're going to need to print it on um, water side paper. You, I let the ink dry for a little bit, then I go and I spray um, one coat, let it sit for 20 minutes, and I spray a second coat um, over top of it. So I'm going to, like I said, leave in the description bar below where I get my waterside paper as well as what type of coating spray that I use and it works for me. Um, also, like I said, if you want to purchase the PDF or the template, you can do so as well. Um, the link for that will also be in the description bar below and you have access to four plus one bonus templates, the ones that I showed you, which will make it super easy. Like you saw to make and start your business or make your own nail decals at home. So I'd like to thank you guys so much for your time today. Um, if you are interested in entrepreneurship videos that have to do with like starting your own nail business or any of that kind of stuff, nails and that kind of good stuff. I will definitely be posting a lot more of those things on this channel. So if you'd like to subscribe, you can do that. But for now, this is it. And this is all already. So thank you for your time and have a good night. Okay. Or good day. It's at least five o'clock in the morning. Goodbye. <laughs>